What's in the box? Could be anything. Could be a new pet, just kidding. Could be a piece of dirt, or it could be a new Rolex to add to my collection. A prized, very rare, hard to acquire, unless you're VIP, wink, wink. But what Rolex is it? Wouldn't you like to know? It's gonna be out of this world, I'm gonna tell you. All I'm gonna say is it's out of this world. Let's start with the knife and let's start by cutting some tape. Y'all ready? Here we go. By the way, if y'all didn't already know, y'all need to follow my cooking page on Instagram at chefboynp. That's C-H-E-F B-O-Y-N, like Nancy, and P, like Paul, okay? Or if you're military, and like November, P like Paul. Follow me on there, share me, and I'll give you all some great more unboxing content later. Here we go, okay? Sorry to waste all this time. If you see my dog in the background, give him a shout out. He's a cute little guy. Can't say still, he's ADD. Don't worry about him. So here we go. I got a knife. I got the box. It's out of this world. What's it going to be? Let's start by opening up the secure seal. Dum dum dum. There's one. There's two. Three. Four. Who cares? I just need to open it. Okay. So, got something good. I got my sidekick, AKA my wife, standing behind me, making sure I'm still in frame for y'all. So this content's important. I want y'all to enjoy it. So she's just making sure that it stays in frame the whole time. Are we good back there? Yeah, okay. Okay, so I'm gonna open this up. Now here we go. Like I said, it's out of this world. What's it gonna be? I'm about to tell y'all what it's gonna be. As you know, this is all original. This is a brand new in-box Rolex, not worn at all. They only sized it and took out a link because they, they do that at the Rolex stores now, but this is unworn. This is straight from the, from the store, straight from the factory. Comes with the sleeve, as y'all know, and if you don't know, it comes with a little sleeve on top. Now I'm a very, I'm a Rolex guy. I'm also a Patek guy. I've had different watches, but there's only ones that, I've, that are on my bucket list and ones that I've been trying to acquire for a long time. Now, unless you have a relationship with an authorized dealer or anybody else, it's hard to get. So this one's gonna be a cool one for y'all. Like I said, I already have a Hulk, all green. I've had Patek Aquanaut. I've had Rolex, Presidential Day Date, Rose Gold. I've had the Yachtmaster Oyster Flex, 126-655. I've had all kinds of different ones. But this one, I've been trying to get for a long time. Now you can see, it's got the crown on the box. Who knows, this box probably costs, this cardboard box probably costs $1,000, but it is what it is. It's cap, capitalism at its finest. Now this watch I bought for a daily wear. I also bought kind of for a long-term investment, but I don't really look at materialistic items as long-term investments unless they're homes or real estate. This is really for a daily wear. Most of y'all will say, oh, you shouldn't wear that. It's gonna get scratched, this and that. I don't care, life's short. You'll be dead before you know it. So, comes with this little $1,000 styrofoam too. There's another $2,000. Unfortunately, it is what it is. It's got the Rolex seal of approval, the little box. Okay, a little shadow box. You can give it to your kids, whatever, to make little things for bougie kindergarten, where, wherever they go to school at. Look at this. I don't even have to blow it off with dust because it's brand new, so I don't even have to do that. Now this is, like I said, out of this world. Got the grown, I mean, got the gold crown right here. Ooh, did you see that? 
Or did I fake it? Fake, fake, fake. Now this is the straight from Switzerland. This is the authentic Rolex box. Like I said, it's unworn. Here we go. Out of this world, right? What do we have here? Brand new, I've never even seen it before. Like you said, I just unboxed it. Dum -dum -dum. Opening, opening, open sesame. Holy bazinga. That's all I'm gonna say, holy freaking bazinga. Do y'all know what this is? Do you know what this is? Like I said, it's brand new, white tag and all. This right here, fellas and ladies and gents, is the prized Rolex GMT white gold Pepsi meteorite. Didn't I say it's out of this world? This is the freaking meteorite. Look at that dial. That is a meteorite brand new that is a piece of meteorite from space. How many people can say they wear a meteorite? Look, I work hard, middle-class guy. I wanted something nice to wear for a long time. I'm gonna, it's gonna be on my wrist. It's not gonna be in a safe somewhere. Don't judge me. I wanted something nice to wear. I'm a Rolex guy. I like the movements. I'm a, I'm a watch nerd. I don't just buy it because of the name. Now, how cool is this freaking thing. Look at the little flakes of meteorite on that dial. Look at that. And it's a GMT, so that means you've got two different time zones. It's actually three different time zones, but two from the hands itself. Now look at that. Look at that dial. Of course, every meteorite piece is a different dial. It, you never know what you're gonna get. It's like a freaking snowflake, right? And I'm not talking about the kind in politics. This is a true meteorite. Look at that. And you know what? This whole piece is white gold. The whole thing. Now, like I said, holy bazinga. This is a Rolex white gold meteorite. Look how pretty that is. It's got the clasp on the bottom. It's unworn, no scratches until I probably drop it in this video. It is what it is. But look at that. Look at that, y'all. What do you think? What do you think, y'all? I know. It, this is definitely a piece that's a bucket list piece. You see that? Look at that. Boom, 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 different angles. Some people like to see people twerk. I like to see watches twerk. Look at that, boom, 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 boom. Neat, right? Yeah, don't judge me. So, let's see what we have in the box. So like I said, came with the one piece of white gold link, okay? Man, I just, dang. How nice. So most of the stuff's gonna be underneath, right here, behind the thing. Now let's see what's here. We got, I'm gonna put this right here for now, y'all. We've got the card, the brochure, the Rolex card. And then we got the model 126. 719 BLRO, otherwise known as Pepsi Meteorite Rolex. Dated June, end of June. So it's brand spanking new, fresh out the box. Beautiful, right? Yes, I agree. Hope one day that if y'all like watches, you can get something cool. If you do have something cool, put in the comments below. Show me what you got. I'm interested in other pieces too. I'm not just here to show off my pieces. I like to see what other people have and how much you appreciate your stuff too because that's what it's all about, sharing the love of watches with each other. So I hope y'all like this video. I'm gonna start doing more unboxing and I want y'all to see all the stuff that I have. Unfortunately, I just started doing the unboxing so I can't do unboxing on everything, but you know, maybe I'll just do some fake unboxing later on just to show y'all cool stuff. 
But like I said, follow me. Follow me on Chef Boy N P. That's C H E F B O Y. N is in November, P is in Paul. I am a veteran myself. If y'all are veterans, put in the comments below and thank you for your service also. God bless America.